So this RTX 3060 Ti is a desktop class GPU with 16 gigs of VRAM. It's gonna perform about what a full power RTX 5070 Ti in a laptop can do. Now, no brand controls my content. I always strive to have honest and authentic reviews. So if you value that in your tech reviews, please consider subscribing. But this is designed to hook up to your laptop and give you much better gaming performance or better AI performance because it has the 16 gigs of VRAM that's gonna mean bigger local AI models running at the same time, as well as better gaming performance with the maximum textures, especially I'd say going up to 4K resolution or ultra high resolution VR gaming, stuff like that. This is, should score around 3,600 or so in Steel Nomad if it has good throughput and all of that. And I'm assuming ideally you're gonna to wanna to run this with Thunderbolt 5, but Thunderbolt 4 and USB 4 are also supported on this. There's quite a few ports on here if you're gonna to wanna to hook this up as a USB dock, basically, you can have two USB A's, a USB 3.2. Uh, you can also have a reset button here. And then on the back, you have a network port. You have your laptop in for Thunderbolt 4, Thunderbolt 5, USB 4, Thunderbolt 4 out, I believe. I don't think you can do Thunderbolt 5 out from a Thunderbolt 5, but maybe, I don't know. It's a Thunderbolt 4 out, so you can use a Thunderbolt dock if you want even more ports. And then you actually have the full port selection from the RTX 5060 Ti. Three display ports and an HDMI 2.1. So you could do like four multi-displays with high outputs out of this as well. So you can get crazy display outputs that you normally could not do with a regular laptop. Not only are you gonna get very respectable gaming performance, you're gonna get great AI performance out of this, and it's actually not gonna break your bank too much. They haven't set the official price yet, but it should be 650, 700, somewhere in there. Very affordable upgrade. If you've got an older GPU, but has a Thunderbolt 4 or USB 4 support on your laptop, or if you've got a current gen, like lower end 5050, 5060, with Thunderbolt 4, like a thin laptop, plug this puppy into that laptop and suddenly, bam, you've got next gen level performance with DLSS 4 support with multi-frame generation. I don't even really use multi-frame generation, but at least two times frame generation is really great to have where you can upgrade a relatively cheap laptop with great performance and it doubles as that high-end USB 4 docking station with great monitor outputs. I don't know. I really love this product idea and I'm glad that they're making it available. Anyway, there is RTX 5060 Ti AI box from Horus. If the 5060 Ti is not enough performance for you, they also have an RTX 5090 AI box, which is like self-contained RTX 5090. Now I'm making a dedicated video on this one as well, but both of these are freaking cool ideas. And if this one costs too much because it's $3,000, you can go for this one, which is only about $700, but a lot more affordable. Thanks so much for watching. We'll see you in the next one. Brandon out.